And we want to be your Poe Town Heroes, your source for all your budget Pokemon needs. What is up, everybody, and welcome back to Poe Town Heroes, where our video quality is improved, but my deck playing has it. I'm Ryhorn Trainer I'll, Steven. I'll, I'll agree with him, but Poke Sign is Sean. And today we get to, uh, I apologize for the long break. I work in the food service industry and just work 13 days straight, so I'm glad we're back to making videos. Yay. So uh, we're going to jump back in. By denying their po your, I have our opponents our hand. So let's jump in and let's see what kind of fun we can have. Because I gotta tell you, I love this deck. Like, it's very simple, it's very straightforward, but it could be devastating in the, in the right hands. So let's see. So, let's well, see if our. Well, uh, this is one of three Pokemon. So it would be either Eevee, Orangaroo, or Ditto. But Solid Water, I'm pretty sure this is gonna be Gyarados. And we already have Probably. the mulligan. So there's not a whole lot of other decks I know of that can run just water on its own. Yeah, so it's either... And going... there's no Naganadal, so I know it's not something that... There's no Psychic, so there's no Naganadal. Yeah, so it's probably either Gyarados or... Just straight up Blastoise. Or straight Blastoise. Alright, so we'll start with a Grimer. And actually, this is a pretty... This is a pretty good setup for turn one. Mars, if we can get, unless we get a basic out of it, we can probably use the Pokemon to. Oh, we will get a Kingdra. basic out of it. So Ooh. Kingdra, Kingdra, Ranger. Is it? That's actually not a bad strategy. Now which? Now which? Now which Kingdra? I I'm gonna guess GX. I'm guessing GX because. And he uses Quagsire, so it doesn't have doesn't need the Naganadal as much. <coughs> yep. Uh, so we'll start things off with the communication. We'll trade. We can probably Actually, actually March out will be nice to have. Yeah. Let's go with the Pacham. We'll draw Pacham. We'll see what we get with the Mars. Very nice. Ooh, we got rid of a Fuel Blower. Very nice. Uh, do, we... do you really want to change your hand yet? Mm. That'd be a good division. Not yet. So let's let's just play it safe. Division. So no matter what happens that, Grimer. And next time we get a switch right for, and go right to for the attack. Yep, I mean that. Maybe we can be... use the bench one as the evolve poke one and use that as a well decoy. I like it. Crushing hammer, okay. <laughs> Alright. Now as long as he's not running enhanced hammers, we should be fine with this deck against this deck. Well here shortly we won't have to worry about anything in his head in his hand. That is true. Well, we'll still have to worry a little bit about what's his, what's in his hand. We just want to know what the official Kingdra will be in this deck. We're thinking K GX. GX. Yeah. Like it's it's pretty obvious. Go with the Hydro Pump, considering the fact you get there's so much water support right now. All right. Actually, he's looking for a candy. Yep, he's looking for a candy. It's just oh, uh, look at that. It's just going to be a shame. Well, let's see if we can mill one. I'm hoping we can mill four of them. Well, that'd be ideal, but... Uh, goodbye Crushing Hammer, goodbye Ultra Ball, goodbye Tate, goodbye Tate. Well, you get, you get, those get all back in the deck, so... Yep, and... Switch to Bangoro, and Marshadow. Now let's just hope we can top deck a DCE with Marshadow. Yes. So we're disrupting him as well, Judge. Taking a great ball. Yep, we can create. See if we can hit the, get the muck. Oh, there, look at that. There's, there's a muck. Now we need to hit candies. I don't remember, I don't remember uh, Kinder deck running more than one Cedra, so. <laughs> and they scoop! <laughs> you either target the deck or you target the hand. Either way, uh, you're you're going to be looking good. We really get to showcase Pangora. We just showcase Grimer. Or, Muck. Nope. So uh, let's take a moment and just kind of show off what the list is supposed to, do, or what the list oh, looks new like. La new oh, ladder. Sweet. It's a new ladder thing. So. Yes, it is. 
We get a Necroza finally. We'll get a Necroza. Very nice. All right, so here we are with the list. Uh, it's a very item heavy list, but uh, it actually really, really works out. Uh, the entire point of this deck is Pangoro. This thing is hilarious. Like, in fact, you we weren't able to judge into another hand either. Well, even then, there's so many ways to control your opponent's hand. Uh, so, again, the deck's based around Pangoro. It's a stage one, 140 HP dark Pokemon. For a dark and a DCE, tighten up, does 60, and your opponent discards two cards from their hand. So when you have four cards and you take away two cards, they have two cards in hand. Do it next turn, they're now top decking everything. Yes. And now to make sure they can't top deck something useful they could use, we're running Alolan Muck, which uh, it's 120 HP stage one. When you play this from your hand to evolve, you look at the top six of the opponent's deck, discard any items you find there, and then shuffle the rest into the deck. So, goodbye Ultra Ball, goodbye Great Ball, Rare goodbye candy. Rare Candy, Fuel Blower. Recovery items. Recovery, <laughs> like, yeah. Stretchers. So, just the two of them by themselves and are water, devastating. And water, got Patch, you're getting rid of too. Mm-hmm. The deck specific stuff, so like the electric decks, you're getting rid of Electro the power. electro power, the choice bands. Mm -hmm. And there's no reliable way to get back items yet, other that, than attacks. So. Yeah. So that this is really gonna slow the opponent down. And if they can't do it, we'll just bring in Mar Shadow. I mean, it's a judge when you play it from the bench to hand. Now we're okay playing with like four cards, because we only really need Well they're playing with two, supposedly, so yeah, so we pretty much just control their, their hand size with the Pangoro. We get rid of a lot of their helpful resources with the Muck. We keep shuffling their hand with Mar Shadow and Judge. Get rid of cards from their hand with Mars. I, I mean, there's just so much that can be done with this deck. I, so I think, I, I mean, is there anything else? Oh! Yeah, Pangoro becomes a zero, in, zero prize card Pokemon. Yeah, Pangoro and uh, Muck, well, if we need if, to. If you need to take a turn to throw a Dark Energy on it. but Yeah, so we control their hand, and if they even get the knockout, well, yeah, they they don't get a price for it. So that, that'll that definitely help us out in the long term as well. Uh, so let's see. Is there anything else special about this so list? If, if theoretically, in the end, you should basically be keeping your opponent down to maybe one to two hand card. Unless they top deck like a Cynthia, mm -hmm. which is the only way he'd get out. Which just means we got more cards to discard from. Yes, indeed. So uh, I think at this point, we're just going to go through the list and uh, show you kind of how ridiculous this list is. So we're running a 2-2 Alolan Muckline, uh, the new one that came out in t uh, Team Up. Uh, we're also running the Alolan Grimer that came out in Burning Shadows, Burning Shadows the division. So you search your deck for a Grimer, put it on the bench. We're only running a 2-2 because of the fact we really don't need to do it yes. more than twice. And even so, we have recovery in order to bring it back, do it again. Uh, we run a 4-4 Pangoro line. Because uh, he's your main hitter. He, he's the main, main focus of the deck. Everything is built for the Pangoro. Uh, we run three Marshadow, uh, the one with Let Loose from uh, Shining Legends, um, just to control their, uh, just to keep them shuffling and uh, keeping an eye on whatever they're they're looking for. Uh, we run two Acrobike because we're wanting to grab out a lot of the essential stuff, especially once we get dropped down to four cards. So that just helps us get what we need. Uh, we run one energy recycler just so we can bring energy back if we yes. need it so we don't deck ourselves out uh, if they get really aggressive. Uh, we run two enhanced hammer. Slow just people down. Slow people down. Uh, it gets rid of DCE, gets rid of the boost energy, uh, the beast, beast energy. Uh, the units don't really see a lot of play, but this would deal with those well, as well. Well, the fairy one does just because nine toes is going to be splashed in almost any deck now. Okay, true. But, uh, yeah, this just deals with any of the special energy that we need to get out of the way. Uh, we run two escape rope. Uh, that way we can switch out if needed, uh, get get a specific target. We could Guzma. If they, their Pokemon aren't the target, they are. Just trying to slow them down. 
And now we're running the escape ropes because we really don't have room for the Guzmas because with our supporters, we want to be either... Judging or marsing every turn. Ju uh, either judging so we can uh, keep their hand at four or we're marsing so that we can just discard a card and draw two. And then with Farangoro, assuming Marshall just got played, they're basically playing down to one card. Mm-hmm. So there, there's that and hilarity that there. And that Mars randomly does one, so... Yeah, so that's... So that's why we're not running Guzma in this list, and we're running Escape Rope instead. Uh, we're, running, we're running two Great Balls. Uh, that way we can grab out any Pokemon out of the top seven. Like Grimer. Like Grimer. And, and we're not having to pay the cost in order to pull them out, uh, just so we can keep all our resources as possible. Uh, we run two Judge Whistle. That way we can pull back Judges if we need them, or, if, we're, or, if, we're, or if we need it, we can draw a card. But we're mostly using it for the Judge. Uh, two Pal Pad, again, this is for the Judge and Mars, so we can keep shuffling those. We run two po uh, Pokemon Communication, so like you saw in our first match, we can go from a Mock to a uh, Pacham, or a Pangoro, Pacham, or we just get the Pokemon we need yes. at the time. Uh, we run two Rescue Stretcher, that way we can shuffle stuff back into the deck, or into our hand if we need it. Um, well, Mock... If you had to sacrifice a muck, you can always just bring it back. Exactly. Or Marshadow. Yep. Uh, so this this is you're pretty much gonna want to use the shuffle. Three. But he's not exactly that frail. I mean, he is, but he's not. He, he's kind of he's kind of a big boy for being a. He could be beefier. I mean, you could throw in the buff padding, give him what one eighty? No, one ninety. Well, yeah. But honestly, it's not even needed if you. But like fighting fear about, they get you in that range of field lore, They not get a free knockout, and mm -hmm. they get to attack your next one. Yeah. So as long as you keep the aggression going, you really shouldn't need like the buff padding or anything else like that. One four is a relatively harder harder number to hit. So. Yep. Uh, we run two super scoop up. Uh, this is so we could possibly bounce back the uh, bounce back the muck if we need to, bounce the pangoro. Uh, and again, this is a coin flip. So with our luck, it's probably going to flip tails most of the time. Oh yeah. But it's still that nice option to have, so you can try to pick either up muck. yeah pick up muck, pick up the Marshadow. Uh, yeah, and bit damage Pangoro. Exactly. When a Pancha is pretty much ready, but one energy cost. Yeah, so we're gonna want to run this instead of the Acerola. Same reason we're running Escape Rope instead of Guzma. Uh, we run two Switch because well it's they switch. are they are kind of beefy and well it's Switch. Uh, two Ultra Ball, pretty standard. A direct version of Great Ball. Because if, if we just can't get a Pokemon, yeah, it's some... you, you can use Great Ball to grab a card and yeah. discard it. Or... Yeah, sometimes you need the Pangoro. Sometimes you need or the Muck. Or the Muck. Because you draw into four cards versus shoving your hand to draw four. Exactly. So this is a more guaranteed getting the Pokemon. Because, uh, again, communication, you need to have a Pokemon in your hand that you can't use in order to swap out. Or Great Ball is just a top seven. But you could usually get away with just the two, but the Ultra Balls are, I need this Pokemon, I don't care. Yes. So that's why we got those in there. We run one Black Market Prism. Because I, we can't run four. Because we can't run four, but even then, Dark Pokemon take one less prize. So oh, hey, Pangoro, they're Pangoro. they're all one prizers. Technically, Pangoro won't, you will probably be an attacker, so, yeah, so will, you won't get a prize off of it? No. Uh, Muck, if we can just drop one on there just in case to, uh, for survivability. It only it wouldn't work for the Pacham or the uh, Marshadow, but at least the two main parts of the deck, it will yes. uh, do that. Uh, we run one Bills Analysis. This is so we can uh, get any trainers yes. or supporters we need uh, because we are running so few. Um, Bill is kind of like a poor man's Jirachi or Ninetales as well, so... A little... Yeah, for, it really is. Even though I, they're all rares, but of the rares, he's the cheapest one of the three. Yeah, I, I will fully admit... I focus to one particular focus. Yeah, I'll admit I don't like the fact that he's a rare, but it's a it's an effective I rare. Do, I do think they should have put an uncommon version of the set, so you have more options. Mm -hmm. Yes, one will still be harder to get. Yeah, I, I, I get it. Uh, we run one Prog's Grit, which I wish was not? the Saiyan one, because, uh, well, so we can bring back well, we six should, Pokemon you know, or energy. Hobo and have him cop it up. I know, I, I, I oh, want... Oh, he had a real one. Yeah, I, I, we have a real one, too. I just want it in real... So let's get it in, in. and say, here, I got it, see? Although it makes me wonder if I could swap... 
You know what? If anyone wants to trade me uh, the new or the team up Brock script for the X and so Y Brock so script, so you'll have one of each. Yeah, like I would be totally okay with that if you are. Uh, so just hit us up. So basically, uh, it's Brock, and then his alone form. Yes. Uh, we run three judge again. This is one of the main supporters we're wanting to play to keep your no, opponents no, not, not playing. It's these main. It's back a, Mars. Yeah. So you're either going to Mars every turn or you're going to judge every turn. You want to go for the judge, but sometimes, sometimes a lady does what a, uh, a woman can do, I what mean, a man can't. I mean, we can just discard a random card. It randomly discards a Cynthia mm -hmm. that they're ho hoping that you they would have been able to keep with Pangoro, but. That is Mars very, says nope. Yep, very true. Uh, so we run three Judge. This is the main supporter we're wanting to use. Uh, we also run three Mars because, again, this is the backup supporter we want to use. Uh, we run one Pokemon Fan Club. Not, uh, I think only the Pan Jam has 60 hit points. The rest of it is, uh, well, above. Yep, and even then, You can grab most, a few Mars Shadows. You can grab Grimers. Even then, they go to the hand. Yeah. So yeah. we use those, load up on Marshadow, play one of them, and shuffle and shenanigans and I don't think you would play, uh, grab both two Marshadows. Well, uh, but you would grab like a, a Grimer, Grimer, a Grimer and a, a Marshadow, a Pan Pancham, yes. and a. Uh, yeah, one of three options, but yeah, two two out of the three options. Uh, we run four DCE and we run eight Dark Energy. Well, because well, DCE friendly. DCE friendly, DCE friendly, doesn't really matter much. So yeah, everything here is DCE friendly. So, so yeah, um, that's pretty much the list. So without further ado, we'll uh, we'll jump back in. By the way, that's a nice hand. So we'll jump it, back into it, another match. It was a nice hand. So we'll jump into another match and see where it goes from there. All right. So here we are with another match. Grass colorless. I have a feeling this is a tag team deck. And if it's a tag team deck, then we might be able to show off how effective it is. Is it tag team or is it going to be the executive or, or? It was... The grass one. Oh, Marsh had a lead. Of course you would. But who knows? I might be able to make this work. One way to find out what they're playing. The fact they didn't mulligan too many times. Tag team. Tag team sell and, or... and, and they didn't mulligan too many times? Wow. I'm... I mean, this is not a straight up sell of Venus or list. I will admit this Durach or this Celebi is hilarious. It just looks like that uh that woman. I, I want to speak to her manager. Yes. Like like that's exactly what she looks like. Alright, so we will communication for Pangoro to grab Pacham. We will play the Pacham. We will DCE on Pacham. Uh, let's try a scoop up. It worked! Okay, uh, we will acro bike. No, for the switch. We will great ball. Fail the search. Well, there's, no, there's no point of putting a hand if we're, we're going to shuffle Yeah, hand. exactly. So we will do that. Four cards. Yeah, no point of putting... No, no, no point I'm, of, I'm no, not... No playing black market until we see their... Uh, exactly. So I'm just going to... Oh. We're just going to smack them for 40. And discard that energy. Mm-hmm. Just slow them down. Yeah, like I said, the shenanigans that can be done with this deck are just amazing. But you well, got the Grove Isle. Let's see what the rest of the deck is about, because there's, there's, so there's, there's so many ways you can the... run it, so. Grove Isle for Sceptile. Aw, it's just a shame uh, you're not going to keep it. Why not? It, well, he's probably just, he probably just running the 1-1-1 one, one, one line. E it, even then, like, he, he's got one energy that he can drop. Yeah. He and, and that's might, all he's gonna have. And we might just smash it back off. So, actually. Ooh. Actually. All right. What are you thinking? Because I'm thinking dark energy here. I don't think we'll need the. Judge whistle. I don't think we'll need the judge whistle. We still need a. I don't want to be using the black market though. But. I, it's. I am pretty sure he's only playing. He's probably playing Aether and or uh, Life Force. So it's a matter of when. 
I think of Black Forest and the Judge Whistle, though, because Marshall gives us more cards. That okay. is true. We'll go Pangoro. We'll play the Pangoro. Oh. Marshadow. So energy has to go back to the deck. Oh hey, we still got a uh, we still got a card uh, supporter to play. So Mars. <laughs> that is beautiful. Um, and let's just get him down to one card. Like yeah, we're gonna take a while in picking at this thing, but we're gonna take three prizes. Unfortunately, the only downside about Pangora is they get to choose, but yeah, or top deck Cynthia's. I played this uh, against a Garchomp deck uh, the other day, and it was uh, it was actually kind of sad the fact that got him down to no cards. Top deck Cynthia. Top deck Cynthia. Top deck Cynthia. Top deck Cynthia. Cheater. It's like come on. Okay, so. All right, cool. So he's got the Pidgeotto. So he's gonna look at the top two. It's not really gonna matter though. Or at least too much. Well, he gets to pick one. The other one gets bottom decked. He needs to go back and get that sept that septile he just milled away. Yeah, he... If only he knew what I had in store. Oh, well, wait. that first attack could be uh, a problem. Oh, you got on, it. on the other one. Uh, let's go... Oh. He already has four cards anyways. Yeah, well, Ultra Ball, getting rid of... Let's go Escape Rope and a Switch. To grab up a Cham. DCE. DCE. Judge. Judge. Oh, we got a card he wanted, because, well... Well, we got a, we got a card that we wanted. Why? The only thing I had to be leery of is that first attack off Sivta. He discards special energy. Okay. Like, he gets rid of this one. We have another one in hand. He gets rid of this one. We have another one in hand. But you only have four with no way to recover. This is true. I mean, I will fully admit it will be annoying, but not, like, as annoying. Another thing about Septile, he's relatively cheap to attack with. Stop the Cynthia's! We'll, we'll get rid of a Marshadow. Like, it's not really gonna matter. Like, even if he's 60s and gets rid of a DCE, it's not it's not gonna hurt well, us. Well, then again, we just see a dark energy. If we're gonna, if we're gonna lose... We're not gonna lose Pangoro, but we might as well put it in range. Put it in range of the two shot. Need a top deck of a dark energy. This one? Mm -hmm. Okay. So let's see. Here, Pangoro. Well, Bill. To grab. Probably a f fan club. Yeah, we got to. We got to just have to poke it for sixty. I was hoping to get a dark energy out of out of the top. I, I know. I was hoping for one too. Well, might as well just discard their part of their hand. Only downside is they get to choose. Yeah, I get. They get to choose the two. Yeah, but something tells you that. Other escape, the other Pangoro is going to be the MVP. This one? Yeah. Yeah, I'm pretty sure that's what's going to happen too. So it's going to be 130, no, 10 short for knockout, it. but it's going no, to be. No, you going to do 60. Why? If you can't one shot, I might as well slow him down. Huh? He went. He went for it. Nah. Cool. Just so he can move the energy here. Because of the fact he's trying to load up the, the Celebi. Which I'm going to escape rope. To well, hopefully... He'll, he'll, he'll give us Pidgeotto. 
Yeah, if he gives us Pidgeotto. Yep, okay. So we will... Yeah. Pangoro. We have access to a judge. We'll grab a judge. Might as well use it. Play a judge. Acrobat? I don't know. We'll Pancham. Then we'll Acrobat. To grab. Oh, no, no. Grab the switch. Grab the switch. But that means we're discarding DC. Yeah, but we can't. We won't be able to attack this turn if otherwise. Okay. I, now I get it. Okay. And 60. Discard two. Yeah, it's a little bit riskier, but. So yeah, we, we need, are. We need to find a dark energy to keep going. There we go. So so we're looking good. Oh no. Although wait, which one's gonna be Do you think they're gonna go for the, the GX on the tag team or Well they're a little ways off from being these any five energy. Well, one one more leaf cyclone and then a DC. Unless we can do something about it. That's what I'm trying to do. Yeah, we've got it we're one turn behind because of lack of an energy attachment, but. Pangoro. But they're not getting prizes off them, so. so no, we just. Oh, no, yeah, they are. Black Force. Or we had to discard Black Market. Mm hmm. I mean, that's, this isn't a bad strategy. I mean, you uh, put the energy on a Sceptile, use the Leaf Cyclone to load it up onto the Celebi. It's not horrible. Something tells me... I don't know. He'll just retrieve DC. No. Retrieval. So he's going to put one on so he can at least Solar Beam for the 150. But if you do, you get two. If he... Well, because if you do two, you get the... One more, you get the reshuffle. It's a little bit overkill. Oh, fully heals. Oh, then it, with the extra energy, a fully recover. You get to shuffle your hand or discard. If he had the one more, so we'll put the energy on Pangoro. We'll just end turn. Oh, we are not looking good. Because now he can just solar beam for 150. He get his hazard for knockout. Well, on pa on the Marshadow, yeah, pa but. Hat, pa Pollen Hazard does 80 going into our turn. Right, but it wouldn't get a clean knockout on the Pangoro. The Solar well, Beam would. he's still going to do Solar Beam on the Pangoro. Yeah, we, we lost momentum a little bit. I will admit that is one of the drawbacks, is that you could easily lose momentum. Well, Palpad and... Uh, we'll do Judge and Mars, I mean. Oh, uh, worse. Well played. You have a good deck. Smiley face. Yeah, we, we lost Pangara. We lost this game. These tag teams are, like, super strong. Yes. Especially when you're pairing Sceptile with it. I mean, if it works, it works, right? Yes. All right, so we'll jump into another match, and hopefully it goes a lot better than this la first one. Or the second one? Or the second one, yeah. I forgot our first one was actually good. All uh, right. I think a lot of it was that we missed an energy attachment. We, we were it, hoping for a dark energy, got a double call us. It definitely had something to do with it. All right, so we won the coin flip. Do we want to go first? Yes, we want to go first. Give us, like, a perfect... Well, that's not, actually a really good turn one. It's not one. perfect, but we'll settle. Like, this is a really good I turn I just throw one. the uh, regular dark on for now. Test the waters first. Is something Naganale. Now, that's like four different decks. That's the Ultra Beast <laughs> Naganale, so... It did, did just say Psychic and Colors. I'm pretty sure this is Naganale bo or uh, Beast Box. With Ditto. So if we can control the energy, which we're going first, 
So we can at least get the Mars. I would love to start things off with a judge, a judge or a Mars shadow. Oh, no, it's... Uh, it's... All right, oh, so draw a card, yes. Oh. Ooh, that's actually not... Another tag team in a row. Yep, so let's you go. you got to play this one carefully because we got two turns. Because he, well... I'm going to go pinch, pinch him. him. <coughs> Mars. Let's Ultra Ball getting rid of a dark. Probably don't need muck yet. Yeah, in the muck. To grab. Grimer. Grab a Grimer. Get Grimer on bench. Let's just save that. Oh, that's right. I can't attack turn one. Man, there's no energy to hit anyways. Sure. That's really the main the reason to use it. Otherwise, it. 40 that resist 20 okay so I mean any damage is any damage but let's see if he can get set up with something all right so we're at least seeing the Lunala energy lotto okay so, so it's not gonna add a Lunala with not gonna add a Luna, Lunala with uh, Gengar as a lead Lun, Lunala GX the one from Sun and Moon mm-hmm you want to move psychic energy around? Yeah. Either Just know we won't be able to play next anything from our hand next turn, so. Thing is, is I'm okay with that. Like, as long as we get set, the Pangoro set but up. But honestly, if I, they could just do the GX tech right now and just lock our hand, so. It, they only need extra energy to force cards in our hand. There it is. All right, cool. So we, we can't play anything from him. That was, if heads, we would have been able to do something. Yep. Well, we're gonna lose Pancham by a lot. We're gonna lose. Yeah. Uh, weakness. Plus, we have four trainers in hand. We do. I mean, with we'll be, with Grimer, we can prolong the game at least one more turn. Andre, we had a pretty good hand. We had a very good hand. There's the call list. That call that Lugia could call ener call energy to itself. Yeah. Deck. Where is it discard? Uh from deck to to itself. So it does way to get energy out of the deck. That's a rarity. Beware? Why not? The draw three beware? Well, it also it also is basic for one twenty base. So And wait, did he get two heads on a timer ball? Probably. I call hacks. Hacks. All right. We still, we well, could still pull this off. But Grammar can get it, pull us another turn. So only four hundred. Only but, only four hundred. Hey, at least we got resistance. Yeah, would have. Hey, Grammar, it's up to you. So we are going to. Ultra Ball. I don't think we'll need Enhance Hammer for this game. And let's go with Dark Energy. We'll grab a Pancham. Pancham. Dark, dark, dark Energy on it. Dark on Pancham. Mars or Mars? Mars. Oh. Whew. Well, Division. Yep. Because they get an exact kill with the resistance. They get hit, they hit, they're hitting for 80 with resistance included. Now let's see if they're going to be that, that player in Guzman. Because one of my one of my ways I got around uh, Gengar Mimikyu is uh, um, Breeding Forest. I was able to because somebody was playing with the Almost Star variant, so I just discarded my extra items I had in my hand. Okay. I got energy out of it, which was something that wasn't an item. Alright, so... Uh, well, Grimer's gonna have to be a sacrificial lamb, so... Unfortunately. I knew uh, we should've Pangoroed. Well, again, Bill. And then hopefully get a switch? Mm-hmm. Or... Yeah. No, no, no. Just, just... Well, actually, Xeabra would be handy. 
I'm gonna switch and great ball. I would. I. I probably would have done this guy real quick. Gengar to the bench. Get something we don't need. We don't uh, escape rope. A switch to Pangoro. Oh. And now he is going to be playing off the top deck. And weakness. One more hit, we knock it out. Yep, and the most he's going to be able to hit us for is, it's what, 50? 50 minus, re minus resistance. 30. So yeah, he's only going to smack us for 30. And being a top but deck. But now he's top decking. Which is all I was trying to get him to do. Because next turn we get a, we get go for the knockout. Mm-hmm. I mean, if we really want to be mean, we could just hit no point. We got the knockout, so we shouldn't need to worry about I would, I would, cards in hand now. I think I, think I would have judged anyways. Just to get more a card to arm Pangor in our hand. I'm going to hold on to judge just in case. I mean, yeah, I get where you're going with it, but I would rather keep him top decking than give it give us a bit of an advantage. Yeah. But hey, we're three prizes ahead. Well, there's, there's our judge. And yeah. Well, we need a great ball and get a pan champ. Mm hmm Or a muck. Well, I don't think he was expecting that. And he's a fighter. There's 60. Or, yeah. Yeah, 60. 40 times. Uh, let's go great ball. Pan champ. Nope. No valid targets. Out of, How? Out of 30 cards remaining. That, that kind of hurt a bit. Uh, let's... Marshadow or Judge? Marshadow. That way, in case we Mars or something, yeah. we can... Still play Mars. Yes, I know. We'll have fewer cards. That's that's actually what we want. Ow! Um... Well, do we want to do this? We don't want to escape rope. No. Well, they are weak to us. Still so, 120, get rid of two. They'll get the knockout, but thing is... If done right, we should be able to get the revenge. Because I think next turn... Yeah, I think I'm going to go with Brock next turn. We've only got rid of one so hammer. We can't like bring the Gengar back out to hit it again. I know, right? That'd be beautiful. Oh, okay. Uh, scoop up. Oh, of course not. Um, escape rope. Oh, Brock. And first then Brock. Rope. Yeah. And then the rest of energy. Uh, escape rope. They both get it. We both get a switch, but okay. So even if he brings up the Lugia, Mar Marshall kind of served his purpose, but Grimer still has one. So mm -hmm. very, very worst safe. case scenario, we could still throw a DC on Grimer because it could still fight. Like part of me is thinking that. Well, I wouldn't just throw one on there. Just well, confusion still a thing. Rescue stretcher, so here it comes. He's going to bring out the Gengar. Yep. It's a smart play. Well, <sighs> the Null is not bad either. You can just force its energy onto Gengar. That is, that is true. Okay. Uh, Gengar, Gengar not going to it wouldn't be too bad with the uh, uh, Null GX engine. Just yeah. to have Null get up, pull the energy out, and throw it onto Gengar. Yeah, that wouldn't be bad. All right, 30, attach an energy. Okay, cool. Um, Super scoop up. Heads. Yes! Unfortunately, we're picking up the one that's in the active. We were kind of wanted. Mark that out. Yes. Unfortunately. Are you kidding me? Judge. I call uh, Judge. Judge, this is a BS hand. I call it Judge. To 
Marshadow again. <laughs> so this is the third time we've shuffled. <laughs> okay, there's two Panchams. I am okay with this now. Panchams. Lucky for us, Pancham. there's Aliza Grimer in the deck. Now. Now we just need now with energy. Is, now we're still basic with his. We still have the number of cards in deck like when we started the turn with. All of that for... Two Panjams and a Grimer. <laughs> yeah. Still no energy, but... No, we just had to hit Gengar twice more. Mm -hmm. Two more times. You know, this is now where I kind of wish we had the Guzma. Just so we can, like, bring up the Mimikyu Q and start... Well, I don't want to bring it up until we're ready. Well, I, Worst case I know. scenario, I want to hit, hit the Marsh at us. Right, but where this would come in, or where the Guzma would come in handy compared to, say, the the escape rope. But then we're missing out on, like, the is judges there, and everything else. In, oh, is there a judge in discard? Uh, I don't think so. So we'll put a judge in the hand. No shiny judge for us to use, so we'll use this one. So we'll put judge in hand. We'll play a judge. Just because we're that mean of people. I guess they're an injured Pangoro. Hold on, dip. hold on. Let's. Uh, we'll grab the communication. Throw an energy Pangoro. Energy on Pangoro. Because we can still shuffle the deck with Grimer. And I think that's what we're going to do. Even though I'm trying to figure out why it would give us a loophole to put one on the bench. It's kind of like using Nest Ball. I know. It would be really cool if we could do that, but even then we were... It would be kind of like using a Nest Ball for no effect. Mm-hmm. I mean, technically, when your bench is full, you, sh you, can't, you shouldn't be able to use Nest Ball, and yet you can't, because there's clearly you can't actually play it to yeah. fulfill the effect. Even though attacks like Division, I guess, get a loophole. Well, because you're looking for one specific Pokemon compared to... Well, we don't have... Well, we do need to excel a little bit longer. We do, unfortunately. Marshadow. Come on. Oh. You know what? Just because I'm Grimer. starting to get tired of his hand. Grimer. Muck. Oh, well, yeah. Throw an energy on Grimer as well, on Muck. So that it, you have two targets for a DC. Well, that's too bad they gotta shuffle that. So they get two, we get two targets for a DC. Alright, so. On Muck. Muck. So we get two targets for DC. I mean, sadly, I kinda want Marshall on the discard because we top deck Stretcher. Yeah, that think, would be nice. The fact we haven't, I don't think we've drawn one yet. Oh. But even then, he can smack for 110. We do need to knock out the Lugia the following turn. Yeah. Well. It really depends on... Okay, so he's going to Gladian. Only downside of this prize is we need to get Gengar up to the active to we catch do. it. To catch in the headlights. So yeah, we need to deal with this Lugia. We need to deal with that Well, Gengar. it looks like Dark Pokemon going up to the active. We'll go Pangoro. You know how I know? The only ones that can deny them the prize? Judge. Right now, they're the only things that can deny prizes. Why? Why, why we're, do you... We're, we're getting... We were doing so well. I'll get him out of the deck. Uh, <laughs> oh, I'll leave the Marshall spot open. <sighs> why why you do this? Why you do this to us, Deck? We treated you with love and care and respect. We we're showing you off and yet you treat us like this. So I guess it is confirmed. It, our video or our video quality has improved, but our deck playing has not. Or at least well, mine hasn't. Any recap on Dew Blade, they went wait until the last second to give us a Dew Blade. The last possible moment for a Dew Blade. If we get a D if we get a DCE after this Pangoro is knocked out, I'm blaming you. Well, like, but 
at least he can't get the cla- or claim the prize on the Pangora. Or the muck. Or the muck. No, we just hope we don't get... Okay, so there's the switch. He's going wings of the moon. But still not enough. Okay, cool. Now we just need DCE. We get, he gets to put it where he wants it. Okay, cool. So, first Mars. we're going to Mars. Well, obviously. DC. Nice. DC. Um, we'll go that and into Pangoro. We'll the, pan- Wait, where's all the rest of Mars Shadows? Do we... Okay, good. We have at least one Mars Shadow we can go for. And, and prize. the prizes. Yeah. Of course it is. We'll go with the Pangoro and at least evolve this one on the bench. Well, it's, the Angar's not hitting anything, so. This is very true. But that's if he goes for either. The downside is. Now, I, is he going to go for the Gengar, hopefully? Or is he going to go for, like, maybe the Beware? Or the. Uh, Lugia. Or the Lugia. We missed the March of But he can't claim prizes right now. As long as we do this right, he can't claim prizes. Although we are only going to have one DCE left. Re- remaining between the discard and debt in hand. Mm-hmm. Or prizes. And we know at least one of them is a Marshadow. Yeah, we know one's a Marshadow. If we're counting cards. We haven't hit our stretchers, so we could still potentially bring back the Shadow in order to... Okay, so he's going with the Beware. Now is he going for the confu- the 120 Confusion or the Mill? Well, if we can't get prizes, might as well... Uh... It's going to take a while for him to line up one for a knockout, so. Okay. We'll bring up the muck. Put on muck. Muck, it doesn't really matter, but. But the thing is, we can't really stall out Beware. Because if they really wanted to, they get his coin flip. Yeah. And start adding to the insult. <laughs> but he's confused right now, which means he'll have to retreat or do something in order to get rid of the confusion. I I almost see him retreating into, like, Mimikyu or Lugia. But he's not getting any knockouts off of Gengar for a while, so... Mm-hmm. At least if we do it right. So come on, what you gonna do? Oh, 14 more minutes, we got a game. I, I don't see this guy being a stall player. No, but the thing is, it, it would kick the turns ahead. Just to Acrobike, we need to f- dig through the deck. Oh. Well, we already know what's going to the top. Even that was all, even that, all that hurt. I don't want to waste the DC. No, so I'll, I'll just put the dark on Pangoro. So we have all the... We'll let him think we're struggling... Because this is our target. The the Gengar Mimikyu is our target. Like, this is what we want knocked out. So we're hoping he gets, like, well, desperate. Well, we want to knock all, all our dark out to have a dark energy, so Marshadow is the last prize. Mm-hmm. Or... Marshadow is the last prize. Literally, Marshadow is the last prize. And he top decks the Guzma. For the last prize. And for like the fourth, I think this is like the fourth video in a row where we get screwed by a last turn Guzma. Well, and RNG did play a little bit of a factor. RNG did play a bit of a factor, but you know like how many times we get effed by by well, that's a like Guzma? Er, that's like every game known to mankind since Guzma was played printed. Yeah, well, our, at, I'm guessing at least the last four videos we've been screwed by Guzma last play. Pretty sure. When we, and people when are we still trying to tell me that there's a guard better than Goose, supporter better than Guzman in farm ads. Like, pick, nah. choo, find me one. There's strong ones for like early and mid game, but let's be real. Guzma is. More games are decided by one of three cards, Guzma being one of them, mm-hmm. than any other card in the format. 
The other one's a choice band. The other one's a DC. Mm-hmm. Changed my mind. Yeah, because you got Lily for the or early game. DC you, slash special energy. Yeah, you got Lily for early game. You've got uh, Cynthia for, Cynthia for mid game. And then you got Guzma for late game. And you're scooping the Guzmas for last little plays. But uh, either way, what did you guys think of the list? Uh, what changes would you guys make? Let us know down in the comments. Uh, while you're down there, be sure to hit that subscribe button. Become a Poe Town Hero yourself. Hit us up on PTCGO. We are Poe underscore Town underscore Heroes. And be sure to check us out on uh, social media at Poe Town Heroes. And we just hit 100 subscribers. So Yay. we, we want to thank each and every single one of you for all the, all the love and all the subs and... Hopefully that you're watching us for uh, for inspiration on fun decks to run in the meta, that or just listening to us bicker and watching us or watching our failures like or, that works too. Or like a flail. But but either way, a thank you. that ran out of flails and now is on the struggle. <laughs> exactly. So thank you very much for for all your subscribers for all for everyone who subscribed. We wouldn't be here without you guys. So, again, big thank you from everyone Peace. here. And as always, may all your games go well, and may the top deck be in your favor. Till next time.